how to zoom, uh, there are three guidelines to think about. First, check the tech. Second is get yourself ready. Next is check the room. So uh, check the tech. Install Zoom. Make sure Zoom is working on your computer. Check the camera works. Check the microphone works. Open your browser and then you need to type in zoom.us. That will take you to Zoom's website and it will look something like this. If you don't have an account, you need to sign up for free and it will ask you for your date of birth. The reason it's doing this is to make sure that you're over 14 years old. So it doesn't matter what date you put in, as long as it's more than 14 years ago. Uh, it will then ask you to sign up for free. You can do this by putting in an email address. There is a way to sign in with Google. Now, your university email is also a Google email. So you have a Google account in the university email account. And I would recommend you use this for university related activities. To get there, you need to go to Akshu. So type in your Akshu account. You know how to log in. You know how to log into Akshu. So you can log into Akshu. When you log into Akshu, you need to go to Gmail SSO. If you continue, it will take you to your Gmail. Once you're logged into Akshu, you can then log into Zoom. Just sign in with Google and it will take you to Zoom. You then need to open Zoom as an application. It will download automatically and go to join a meeting or host a meeting. Go to host a meeting, then you can choose to have video off or video on. You'll need to have video on. Now it's downloaded the Zoom app, which you then need to install. What do you usually do when you install apps on your computer? So the installation is successful. Now you can open this. So you can join a meeting on Zoom. Zoom wants to use your microphone. So your computer probably has a microphone and you can use the microphone on your computer, but you need to tell your computer to let Zoom use the microphone. So here we are in Zoom. So sign in, sign in with Google. This will take you to your choice of accounts. So it will take to Zoom. So when you get to Zoom, um, this is what your Zoom page looks like. You can start a new meeting, you can join a meeting. If you click to start a meeting, you can test whether everything works. So click this on, there you are, talking to yourself. If you can't see yourself, it means your camera is not working. There's also a way to test, so you can test whether you can hear the ringtone. You can also speak and pause, and it will tell you whether your microphone's working. If you check everything is working before the meeting, then the meeting should go smoothly. So you have two buttons at the bottom. If the sound is not working, there are three reasons why the sound is not working. One of the reasons is that you don't have a microphone on your computer. Another reason is that your microphone is on the computer, but the computer does not allow Zoom to use the microphone. And the other one is that the microphone is switched off within Zoom. So at the bottom of the screen, there is a microphone switch and a camera switch that you need to switch on the microphone not mute it and switch on the camera, not mute it. And then you'll be able to speak and people will be able to see you. You can also change the background behind you. This is a function you need to enable. Uh, there are a few standard choices of pictures you can put behind you. Uh, there are preset choices, uh, Golden Gate Bridge in San Francisco, some kind of um, foresty type, greeny type vegetable garden and space. So you can also add other images of your own choosing and put yourself where you want to be. If you have photos in your computer, um, feel free to choose some of your photos if you have any. Uh, check the tech, install Zoom, check the camera works, check the microphone works. Get yourself ready, um, get up in good time for your meeting, get dressed, at least from the waist up. <laughs> Check the room. So 
don't have a window behind you. If the lighting is from behind, it makes your face dark. Uh, if your room is messy, think about using a different background. You can set this up within Zoom. And don't let anyone disturb your meeting.